Former Vol Bobby Mays isn't just concerned about assists per game and shot selection. He's also up on the world economy. For instance, a sagging euro has hit U.S.-born basketball players in places like France and Italy and Greece. Mays plays in Europe and is back home in Tennessee on a midseason Christmas break. Bobby Mays knows the pressure of playing basketball in the SEC. But since he left Tennessee, Mays has discovered the pressure of playing professionally in Europe. So many players I've seen, you know, there for a week or so, and if you're not performing at a high level, then, they, I mean, your contract is terminated because they expect so much from the Americans. Last year, Bobby played in Russia. This year, he's in Cyprus and averaging 16 points and six assists for a team that's in first place. The pay is good even if the fans bring a certain unrefined quality to the surroundings. There's times where you might see spit fly across, you might see somebody flick a cigarette, like it's, it's that uh, type of atmosphere. The team that you play with, you know, the whole city embraces you. Um, it's in, it isn't 23,000 at every game like the University of Tennessee, but uh, uh, it's a great atmosphere to play in and, you know, I love it. When Mays played for the Vols, UT fans expected and got success. He's one of at least five former Bruce Pearl era players still playing professionally in Europe. I think about their last game against Michigan State, just one point away from making it to the Final Four. I mean, I love the opportunity that Tennessee gave me. I, I'm grateful I always come back and support, and wherever I go, everybody know, you know, I went to Tennessee. Bobby returns to Europe in two weeks. He'll be with his team over there through April.